Next, let's add some time to the photo that we put in earlier. How to do that, when I move my cursor over the photo or the still image that we want to increase the time of, there are several ways to get to the to the to the area where we want to increase the time. One, let's just double click on the photo. And what what it brings up here is an inspector. And this inspector you can move around. And right now it says the duration of this still photo is only three seconds. And if I want to make it 12 seconds, I can just highlight it, type in 12. If you want to make all of your still photos, let's say I had 10 still photos in here and I want to make them all 12 seconds long, I can click on this box that says apply to all stills. And I really like that option when you want to change uh, the duration of pictures quickly. So I'll make it 12 seconds and I click done. And now notice how it's changed the looks even within my project here. It even actually made it larger here. Uh, it made it look longer because it is. It's 12 seconds now. Let's say I want to make that 20 seconds. I simply double click on it again, highlight, type in 20, click done. Now it's even longer. Now I have this 20 second still photo here and there, there isn't any uh, music with it, there isn't any voiceover for it, and I just don't want it to be silent in a silent uh, section of my movie. So what I need to do here is come down and hover over this microphone. It says record a voiceover. When I click on that, immediately it says here, click a clip to start recording. So wherever it is that you want to start recording, you simply click in that area. Here's a floating window again, browser window, or inspector window, and I am not going to use my built-in microphone. I have a snowball hooked up, so I'm going to choose snowball. How I know that my microphone's working properly is I can see the bars here moving, which they are. So now that I've picked my microphone, it still says click a clip to start recording. I'm going to click right here and then it will count down and then I can say what it is I need to say. So I will do that. Here we go. So here at the Lifelong Learning Center during the Summer Tech Institute many people had the chance to catch up with old friends as well as gain new knowledge in using technology. When I was done, I clicked again to stop the recording. And now look what I have below here. I have a voiceover recording. It's purple here. It says 19 seconds. Okay, so if I'm done doing this voiceover, I'm going to click X to get rid of that inspector window. And now let's hear what I've, what I've done. If I want to just hear this section, you simply click spacebar on your computer. You, you put your, your, your playhead here, and then click spacebar, and then let's listen to it. So here, at the Lifelong Learning Center, during the Summer Tech Institute. Okay, so it worked. And if I didn't like that recording, I could simply click on it, and then I could click the delete key and it's gone. But I think I'll keep it, so I'm going to edit, undo, that's command Z, and it'll put it back in there. So command Z, and it's there. If I wanted to move this around, I can simply click on that voice over recording and move it back and forth or put it exactly where I wanted it to be.